Hey uh, folks, Quill18 here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Stellaris, where we're the pacifist Quillian bureaucracy, and yet people seem to keep wanting us to stop being pacifists because they're big, huge jerk faces. So what I've been wondering is, should we just spam the hell out of all the habitable planets within range? Sort of like, habitability be damned? It's an interesting question. Um, like, here's a size 20 world. It's like 40%, so we'd be capped at 40% happiness. But how much of a problem is that? And of course, we do have some text coming in for bonus habitability, so then we get to 45%. I mean, you know, that's something. We can also initially uh, colonize this stuff with robots, you know, to get more minerals and, and whatnot, and just move a handful of people in. It's certainly a possibility. I don't know if it's good, bad, or what, but it might be and thing, right? Like, over here, if we just start this, now that we've got droids, you can settle once you've got droids. Um, it'd actually be nice to settle on one of the energy bits. I guess it doesn't matter that much, but we don't want to obliterate the minerals. So, like, say we settled here, for example. You know, that that's a possibility. It's a pretty decently sized planet. Um, the expansion planner, again, teases us with this Paya system over here, but the Paya system isn't easily reachable. We don't have access rights through the Mekonas Sovereign Planets, uh, nor do we have access rights through the Rexo Consolidated Suns. They, don't, they both don't like us that much. The Ogi Nolox actually like us a fair bit because they're both we're both pacifists. It might actually be a good idea to develop a relationship with these guys. Fleet power is overwhelming compared to us. Um... And yet, it might not be a terrible idea. Who knows? Maybe we could form something against these fellows here. Well, they're pacifists as well. They just don't like us. Because we are rivaled. <sighs> hmm. So, you have non-aggression packs. You're rivaled by some of the same people. Um... Defensive. Oh, you have a defensive pact with the Suns. So if we were to attack the Suns, you would jump in here. So we got to figure out a way to maybe improve this. Maybe we can form a federation with them or something like that. There are a few different options. Let's go ahead and... Uh, oh, it costs us a bunch of influence. I forgot about that. Hmm. What else we got? How about research agreements? That you'd be kind of willing to do, especially if we throw in some extra trade. I mean, we're not going to transfer systems or anything like that. Star charts. No, we're good. So we'll just we'll just throw uh we'll just throw a couple of credits at you. No, you don't want any credits at all. What about minerals? Aha. There we go. So let's get a research agreement. Because we might get some decent discounts. I mean, I have to, like, keep an eye on things. I don't know if it, like... Oh, shoot, I could have asked for a longer deal as well. Uh, that's okay. Um, I ha I don't know if I've been really paying attention to whether or not we've got research agreements for some of these things. I think you have to mouse over to point out. I mean, obviously we'd see that the cost would be lower, but I don't usually make decisions based on that many ticks, based on cost, but I'll have to mouse over to see if it happens to be something we get a discount for. God, I, I want I want that, but yeah, we can't really get in there. Still, it also it might be worth grabbing this, just to solidify our control over this little region here. Lots of good tiles for us to improve. <clears throat> it's probably worth doing this one, actually. So, just drop some droids to start off with. Well, we can always just build droids once they arrive. Like, because they still have crap output for everything. They're not that bad for energy credits anymore. But yeah, maybe we'll do that. And once it arrives, we'll go ahead and build a, um, build a bunch of droids to finish it off. I like the idea of having some of our own species here. We got a lot of tiles that can now be unlocked because we just did this. This is going to be a lot more energy. Holy cow. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and clear these all. And then figure things out afterwards. Uh, we'll clear that. You are busy. We can clear this. We can upgrade you and you. And you. Uh, wow, tons of tiles over here are clearable. 
There's not like a bulk clear button, huh? Okay, well, we'll come back and do a few more after. We'll do a few over here. Because overloading one Q doesn't help us that much. We're about to settle over there. We are already at our 9 to 9 limit, so we'll have to do some, some sector stuff. Uh, these guys are doing migration treaties. That's fine. We have an idle construction ship. So can it get... No, it can't. Well, go ahead and set up everything over here. And I guess what we should do is build a new construction ship. I want the Hanari. I want this. Yeah, minus a thousand because of hostile attitude. Totally unwilling to negotiate. Need to be able to, like, construct new hyperspace lanes. I mean, these guys are fine. Actually, we'll probably just turn this into a sector because I think thematically it makes a lot of sense. Do you have... Do we set up star bases at you? Yeah, you've got it. And the yawn system, you've got a star base as well. Okay. Um, I don't think upgrading the spaceport increased their strength or not. I don't know. I always wanted it to, and it didn't used to. I don't know if anything has changed there. Let's go ahead and build a science lab over there. Oh. That's interesting. So they've joined a federation here. You know, we'll have to keep an eye on this stuff. Uh, what was I about to do? I was going to do something. We got the new construction ship. I, I think I'm just going to make a sector here now because we're going to need a sector because we're, we're like um, colonizing new planets. And yeah, thematically, it makes great sense that this is a sector. So we're going to do that and that. I guess we'll do that. I don't know if there's any resources there. Um, but we'll go ahead and get that set up. So the public relations sector. And public relations is, I hate you, you suck. Why the hell did you go and take over this territory? Uh, we are going to go ahead and give you a leader. There we go. We've got room. Uh, same kind of age. This is resilience. More food, hydroponic farms. Um, I'll just go for the longer lived leader. Give some, some positive traits over here. And in terms of settings, you can build robots. Do respect the tile resources. But otherwise, I would like you to focus a bit on research, if you could, please. Um, we're going to change... There you go. We're going to start taking more of your resources over here, because you have a crap ton. And we are going to send you a thousand minerals and a thousand energy to get started. Or not a thousand energy. Some of energy, just to keep that running. Oh, what's this? Drain sector stockpile. Drain 75% of the sector stockpile, transferring blank at a cost of blank. Okay, we don't have infinite influence here. So we're going to leave that be. Okay. So that brings us to 7 of 9. Which is good, because we're still colonizing. So this is a size 20. It's got a lot of Im uh, unremovable blockers, though. I mean, we could get a handful of minerals from this. Like with robots on this, you know, low happiness planet. Um... I think we're going to go and colonize here. Oh, it's got the alien pets. Yeah, yeah. We're going to go ahead and colonize over here, then. Um, these are all still the same type of people. I mean, we could use the different expansion planner, too. But... 8% is fine. We'll drop you down... Uh, I don't think it really matters. There. Um, so this is going to be our Xenobiology Research Lab. Presumably it's going. I hit enter. Okay, you've queued up a colony ship, so it must be in there. And yeah, that's going to be quite nice. Um, but we might want to go and grab as far out here. This can, Desert World's not too shabby. I think, oh, because we've got the other race. Um, you one of these guys. They're going to get the 60% because they've got the Savannah preference. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and push out. It's going to be fine. Um, it's not going to be much adjacency if I go here, but... It'll make use of the energy a little bit more powerfully early on. So you go ahead and do that. Uh, still only 40%. Maybe we can get, we'll get some more habitability stuff later on for that. But yeah, we may as well use our power, which is we can colonize more stuff than you might expect. You've got an inactive building, which is fine. 
Um, I guess we'll go ahead and upgrade you. Maybe not worth upgrading you right now, because there's nothing there. Gotta unlock, like, more cool building type stuff. Somewhere along the way. Everyone is busy building things. That's great. We got people in our little sector. That's fine. Association status. Yeah, these uh, these things are expanding. I don't suppose... I gotta keep an eye on, like, what your name is. Federation status. So, yeah, you're in a federation as well. And I'm all alone. I may have made some not friends earlier. These guys hate me. These guys hate me. These guys like me, but... Oh, but the... Oh, you were in the same one. Oh, are you? Consolidated Sons. Mm, yeah. Uh, so we're going to keep going alone. We'll see how well this pacifism thing keeps going. Uh, we established a colony there properly, which is very nice. You're in position there, you're in position there. We are going to clear this as quickly as possible because we're going to want to build a frontier outpost there. May as well build a farm here. And yeah, we'll get some more droids. There and there. Get that started. And... Oops. Mine and... Mine. Okay. Doopy 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 doop doop. Xenon Biology Research Center. Wait. Did I rename the wrong thing? Was this always Xenobiology Research Center? Because this is not... Is this one not supposed to be Xenobiology? This does not have the pets. System survey oh, I used that name twice. This is Re Xenobiology Research Hub versus Lab. It's not that. This is like, not zeo Xenobiology. This is more like Xenoarchaeology. Let's rename you. I'll get rid of the long name. Xenoarchaeology. Or, is archaeology the right thing? It's, um, if you're studying active living cultures, um, um, uh, there's a different word for it, but I'm going to call it that anyway. It's fine. All right, surveyed, surveyed. Construction ship here is idle. I'm wondering about just smashing it, because what the hell are we going to do with this thing? Right now, it's stuck. We're just paying fees for it. We can just rebuild it later. You know what? That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to disband you. It's fine. This construction ship's been idle since it got built. I, f I, I remember seeing it getting built, and then I forgot to do anything else with it. So, oops. We settled there. That's going to fall within our borders relatively soon, which is great. Um, we should probably focus on tech. Like that. Build a lab. At the same time, minimizing travel time wouldn't be the worst idea ever. There we go. Uh, oh, you're outside. Come over here. Nice lab. And I mean, if you're there, of course, you're going to go ahead and do this. Now, we still have the Enigmatic Fortress over here that we're going to want to take care of at some point. But I don't know what its military strength is. And there's no way to tell. Atmospheric filtering. There we go. More habitability is going to be really relevant right now. More tile blockers. Good. Research treatment. There you go. Boom. Go ahead and do that. And... How are we doing on tech guys? Yeah, I guess that's the way it is. I don't suppose we've got someone more relevant. Not really, no. Okay. You, our research treatment expired. Can we get that back? Excellent. Interesting. Um, these guys are far away, these hazard guys, right? Right over here. Yeah, we're not going to come to war in ages, so let's just go and do a really long-term research agreement. I could have checked the the, um, the comparison numbers. Yeah, so we'll both, we both have a lot of opportunity to learn from that, so that's going to be really handy. I guess we have open borders with these guys. We should probably shut our borders to... Um, not you, but you, since we can't be friends. <laughs> I 
Oh, I guess this is fine. Oh, that's that. Go away. That was the expired one. You would like one of my Teladar crystals, of which I do have two. You know what? Sure, fine. It's going to be okay. <clears throat> A lot of people sitting idle right now. That's also fine. <clears throat> oh, yeah, this ocean world. So, was I colonizing you? System survey I was, right? I did do that? Yeah, yeah, there we go. The button was grayed out. And then some people just showed up. Okay, so now we got vision. So this enigmatic fortress, we still don't know what its strength is at all. We can't spa, ancient vaults, ancient guardians. We have no idea. I've never dealt with these guys. I have no context whatsoever. Perhaps when we can build battleships, we'll be able to get something going. Um, it might be a good idea still to hammer out some destroyers here for a little while. Research on tab blockers, good. Hypercom's form is what? Build it for more unity. Uh, planet unique. I wonder if it's... It's probably an upgrade over the other one. So that seems like a pretty good idea. No, we don't have the discount. We do have a discount here. We have a discount for more tab blockers, which is always very nice, though. You know what? Let's go ahead and grab that. That's fine. Just because of optimization. Humiliate, cleanse planet, cleanse planet. That's happened. You guys are exploring, so you're busy, you're doing things, you're sciencing, which is great. This area over here, isolated. Did you, oh, did you build your own construction ship? Construction complete. Ew. PR. Space construction. Okay, I mean, I guess that's fine. It's a little weird, because there's nothing for you to construct, but if I don't have to micromanage... I mean, it's still costing us money, but I guess that's okay. I don't know. So we haven't done any changes to our ships in a while. Uh, what do you want? You want... I have two of those, right? Yes, I do. That's the hazard. It's not much money, though. But you know what? Let's do it. Maybe we can build up some trust or something like that. I'm okay with it. Military station. Hmm. So you gone and settled there. There could... There's still plenty of systems we haven't even seen over here, so there could be planets that way. A new faction? Alright, how's our faction status? Let's get some cranky people. Plus 4-4. Four, four. We're 77% happy. How come we don't get more joy due to the support level of faction? Okay, so... Can we just promote this? You guys are super happy. <laughs> AI allowed, machine love, bleeding edge, science without borders, synth envy, traditions of discovery. So you like all that. Do we only have two rivals? Oh, that's the that's the militarist. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so we've got literally every single thing over here. The materialists. I think we're supporting them as well. So we're trying to get some more people in here. Yeah, that's going to be okay. Adopting any traditions emphasizing prosperity. Yeah, um, hold on. Did we not do that? I thought we were going to do that. Traditions. Oh, I adopted harmony. Right, for a bunch of happiness, which is pretty good. We could just unlock prosperity. It'll delay getting our next ascension thing. Um, oh, 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 we can do flesh is weak. Right, because we unlock droids. Yes. Robot maintenance cost down. Robot build speed up. We'll prepare a special project to enhance our citizens with cybernetic implants. I don't know what that does, but I want it. <laughs> we now possess both the technology to make advanced cybernetic implants and the means to mass-produce them. Medical centers throughout the Quillian bureaucracy are standing by to begin the surgical grafting process on our citizens. In the future, possessing neural implants and at least a rudimentary level of cybernetics will be necessary to function in the technological society we're building. Consequently, the conversion process to install a basic synthetic suite will be mandatory and free of cost to all our citizens. Issue special project, the flesh is weak. Wow. That's going to take a long time. Well, we're going to finish the battle tech, battleship research. Um, we may want to prioritize engineering labs afterwards just to get more engineering research output so that we can make that go faster. I don't think it makes sense to stall that much of a research right now. 
this is kind of annoying me that we don't have that system, but not enough that I'm going to start a war over that one. I got a whole other reason to start a war over here. Same species, but you know. Um, okay. Biolabs. I don't suppose we got it. Oh, we do have a discount. And these sorts of things are falling within our borders. Might not be bad. Although, I think we're going to grab Adaptive Bureaucracy. What I'm wondering is, with the max influence from faction, will that, is it lying in that it's not just the max, but like, will we actually get more? So will this go from like, assuming our max is currently one, so it's got a base of plus two, is the base going to go to plus three so we'd actually have like 0 0.6 influence from these guys? That, I don't know. Oh, we're above our sector limit. Mm -hmm. Now, one of these planets, this one here, Enim, Oh no, that's my main race. So first of all, actually, we're gonna make sure to build a. Can I not build the zoo? Did it? Oh, I need planetary administration, so we need more pop on this planet before we get there. That's fine. Uh, we will go ahead and build that. Um, we will certainly be building a um, frontier clinic on that one. That's going to be fine. Uh, probably clear some of these blockers early on. Get that going. We'll just leave you be for now. Actually, why don't I do that? Yeah, I like that. You, hold on, are you happier over here? Why are you getting a penalty? Inefficient planet management. Oh, we're getting less credits because we have too many sectors. That's why we're getting the red. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I think we are, is it this one here? Oh, which we need to rename. I think we're calling that, colonizing that with the other race. So I could reach the sector up, but I don't think it makes much sense. Um, maybe this area over here becomes a sector. Got a fair number of planets. Yeah, you know what? Let's sectorize that. It just feels kind of right. I mean, you don't need this many planets in a sector, but we may as well make the sector, like, functional. There and there. There we go. You're going to have plenty of resources. Boom. Boom. So, ZNL Biology Sector, that's going to be fine. We can do the um, the Unity stuff as well. Um, planets and Sectors. I would like to have a leader run this. Um, more XP, Tile Blocker cost. I don't know if that's super relevant. Let's just go for the XP. That's going to be fine. Take a nice production boost. You're getting a decent amount of resources. We will go ahead and give you a bunch of minerals and some energy to get started. I mean, your income's not bad, but... You can't go more than this, right? You know, 75%. So we'll leave that here for now so you can do that. Your sector settings, sure. Again, do we want to... Yeah, respect tile resources. Okay, it remembers that as a default, which is great. Um, and yeah, mostly work on science. I mean, this if we get a little too much science, we might end up tagging our economy. But mostly we've done okay. Currently clearing blockers. Constructing two pops. Oh, you're building robots. Nice. Yeah, we want some of that. You haven't started anything yet. But look at everything they're doing. I love being able to see what their plan is. That's really... I love it. You're upgrading the planetary stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, 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 good. Uh, we've got some planets here that don't have star bases. So we should spaceport all the things. What is it? F5. F5 to open that. Okay, and... That'd be an easier way to do this. Oh no, you have the solar panel network, but you do not. Like, it'd be nice if you could just click on this to go directly to the spaceport view instead of having to click on the planet. But you should have solar panels everywhere. You are missing. Oh, that's the new planet. Mm hmm. We'll get you there. Uh, over here, spaceport, and go. All right. So, that's a little tricky. I do love the, the greater leader lifespan. Oh yeah, and less unrest. Yeah, I think we have to get this, actually. Because unrest is kind of a problem. And the sooner we finish this, the sooner we get another Ascension perk. But I was debating unlocking Prosperity. Like, if you would just unlock the first tier of a lot of these things, you make your a lot of your factions a lot happier. Um, hello. The ocean world. You are very nice. Um, 
So ocean world. This is going to be our strategic, strategic water reserves. Because you never know what might happen. It does feel weird that there's not like there doesn't seem to be a confirmation here that we've got a colony ship underway. Seems a little bit odd to me. Idle construction ship here. That's not good. Uh, yeah, we should actually prioritize all the places with engineering tech. Uh, there's only one there, but what the hell? Um, okay, there's just a lot of tech here. Not engineering, but that's okay. Uh, a fair amount of engineering tech to be had in this area, so it's actually really good that we're expanding over here. Really very good. Basically, it's still a little bit small, but that's okay. Battleships are coming soon. And again, you have the max level spaceport here and here. And there, actually. Oh, Bureau Ships clearly deserves spaceport upgrades. Too many colonized systems again? Maximum leader. Chemical Bliss. Ah, uh, a new standard of living. Well, I mean, if we're going to have... Is that a Blorg? Oh my god, that's a Blorg! Where we're going, we don't need skin to feel. Um, And we get a discount at it. If we have a high happiness cap because of our freaking... Um, our race traits, it might make sense to do this. More, more core systems is fine, but hardly critical. Let's go and unlock this. Plus, it's a rare tech. And you always want to jump on rare techs when you get the chance, right? That's cool. Um... Oh, alien vessels. Okay. Let's research you. Oh, that's these guys. It's just a station. It's fine. I think this might become another sector here. We'll wait until we drop some more planets and just, you know, double check. Um, Curator Enclave. Yes, hello. Nice to meet you. Guarding point defense. I wonder if I should do a pass through the creators. I do have a lot of resources. We might be able to do stuff. Advanced combat rolls is really handy. We don't have a discount for it. I mean, hell, we're still colonizing. It might still be worth picking this up. Or, like, better combat tech, the new disruptors for shield damage. You know what? We'll get the AI-controlled colony ships. Might actually be handy-dandy. Ooh, been destroyed. Well, that's a shame. Right, so, um, if we just filter down to the others. So I think we're still, yeah, we're patronizing them. Gain access to an art monument with the following planet effects. So we can make plus 10% happiness and more migration on a planet. It would use up a tile. Okay, I'm going to say yes. So, presumably then, we could find, like, one of our big planets that had an empty spot. We actually don't have one here, but... Oh, because we just cleared a million blockers. That's a lot of unity! There we go. Bureau of Ships actually has got a nice empty tile right here. More migration attraction. Keep it nice and full all the time. That sounds okay. Um, go ahead and do that. Although, again, we need to get engineering labs. All of these tiles are full of stuff, except you, which is empty. Although, what are we going to do with you? Just put down another lab? Maybe. That's probably fine. Oh, yeah, we can't do the zoo yet. We need more pops here. And you're still clearing tiles. It's a tiny planet, but I love the fact that we get the little critters. Uh, you're expanding. We need... We need to clear some blockers, and then we need to build some robots here. Let me move you over here. Build droid. I'm sure we'll be splitting you off into a, sec a, a sector soon, yeah. System survey complete. Let's do it. Kind of tired of naming these things. I'm going to be perfectly honest. It's starting to be a little harder. I didn't think we'd have so many planets to name. Uh, I think these guys are encroaching a little bit. I mean, I could put down a Frontier post here. I'm not sure that's worth it. 
Hmm, I would be a little annoyed if we lost that. Which is probably what's going to happen. Battleship tech, done. Excellent. Uh, engineering facilities, I want. First of all, I knew there would be a discount, and we need to get extra engineering tech on the way. And we did send some things over here, so yeah, that, um, that is going to become a sector. I think we'll have to wait. I mean, I could do this as a sector now, but I'm just going to wait until someone arrives over here. I'm pretty sure we've got someone. Yeah, yeah, you there. And then we'll be able to make this all nice and convenient. So let's get the max level spaceports in these areas, because that makes sense. We'll work on our battleship tech soon. AI-controlled ships. Uh, Antimatter reactor. We've got the discount. It's a big research. But with the discount and unlocking new reactors is really helpful for things. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to shift... Oh, we still don't have a high base amount. Never mind. Well, I was going to shift the edict to do engineering research so we can get the research labs um, researched faster. What do you want? Star charts? Sure. Oh, we actually did learn a little bit. Inactive building over here. Yeah, that's that. That's fine. You are going to get a droid there. You're already working on that, which is good. I guess I can move you here and have a droid farm. You don't get a bonus, but you don't get a penalty. That'll do. Okay. So yeah, just waiting for that. Well, I guess this is a good time for us to put in a bit of a cut. Uh, oh, you're done your queue. So yeah, battleship tech. Well, that's it. Next episode, we're going to go ahead and design our battleship. And I don't know if we've gotten any component changes to... Uh, oh, you know what? I forgot that we had cruisers we never got around to building. Making quite a bit of a jump here. Okay, we're going to do that. We're going to take care of this next time. Thanks for watching. See you there.